Hey guys, I hope you're having an awesome day. I just wanted to explain what your assignment is going to be for the day. So at the beginning of the year, I talked maybe briefly about how you will have a portfolio project that will be due at the end of the semester. Now the portfolio is basically like a PowerPoint or Google Slides about each of the projects that you've created throughout the semester. So I'm gonna kind of explain what I would like you to do today. So it's gonna be pretty simple, but if you click on the laptop here in my homepage on Canvas, it will bring you to this. So this says portfolio project. If you are a beginning ceramic student, you'll click here. If you're an advanced ceramic student, you'll click here because I don't want you to do the same thing you already did last year. So um, beginning ceramics. So let me just go ahead and click this one. So this tells you what you need to have on each slide, okay? So you need to have a slide for your slab project with a photo and then like your glazes that you use, your coil pot, pinch, wheel, combination, pot, bonus. Um, oh, that needs edited. I don't know why that adds that. <laughs> um, strengths and weaknesses, future project, and then three things you learned suggestions for me. Now this is worth 50 points. So you're, it's going to be about, I think 10, no, 11 slides technically. Um, so let me explain how to kind of start this. If you go back to this right here, where it says example, this has um, an example from a previous student on her portfolio. So you can kind of see what you're working towards. So you have a cover slide and then she has her slab pot with a picture of her slab pot and then how she made it, okay? Then you have your coil pot, what glaze she used and then the techniques that she used with a photo, pinch pot, wheel pot. So she just put all of them on one slide. You can put all of them on one slide or you can divide them out. It doesn't matter. Um... So this was her, uh, like a video technique, and we can talk more about that later. Strengths and weaknesses. So she did three strengths she's good at with ceramics and four weaknesses, but you can just do three strengths and three weaknesses. Future projects. So these are some pictures she found that she might want to do if she takes it again. Things that she learned about ceramics. Suggestions for me. Again, she's just following along on each slide. So suggestions for Mrs. Rock. And then I think that's it. So that's it. So what I want you to do today is you can either use PowerPoint or Google Slides. I'm gonna just gonna open up a PowerPoint for now. And you're going to label each of your slides. Now you may not have information to input in each slide, but I want you to have like the header it's called for each slide. So I'm gonna start off ceramics portfolio. Um, Morgan Schrock. Advanced students, you need to make sure you follow along on the advanced one. And then if I can look, I'm going to look back and see what I need here. I need slab, coil, pinch. Okay, so I'm going to go back to this. Slab, coil, I'm going to make add another slide. Coil, you can do this on um, Google Slides too, whatever you find easier. Coil, pinch, and you're gonna do this for each header, okay? So each header that's on here, you need to make a slide for. And then you need to start adding in backgrounds, okay? So you, I would prefer if you didn't just use the backgrounds that were pre-made on here, because those are boring. I've seen them all, trust me, I've seen them all. So if you go to like Google, let's say I want like um, boho aesthetic background wallpapers, okay? That's what I want to go for, all right? So then I can click on these. And then I can insert these. Copy. Paste. And now I've got to stretch it a little bit. I could either go to these design ideas. Actually, this one doesn't, this one kind of stretches a little weird. But now I need to, because now all my writing is gone. 
So I'm going to go to send to back. Okay, so now my writing is still in the front. So you can either come up with a full theme for your PowerPoint or do like a different um, photo for each background. It doesn't matter. And then if you want to click some of these design ideas on the side, you can too. Like that one's kind of cool how it fades. However you want to do it. So your assignment is to create each slide for your portfolio and add in backgrounds and headers. That's it. After you're done, you need to make sure that you save it. Ugh, you must save this. So if you're in PowerPoint, file, save as, and then save it either on your desktop, in a ceramics folder, whatever. And make sure you label it something like ceramics portfolio. That would probably be smart. Or um, if you're in Google um, Slides, let me show you how you save it in Google Slides. So let's go to this. I'm going to go to my drive. New Slides. If you're in Google Slides, you just need to type it right here where it says Untitled Presentation. So Ceramic Portfolio. And this will save to your Google Drive. So it'll be in your Google Drive and it automatically saves. So either one. Please let me know if you have any questions. Um, you're going to work on this today. And if you have any questions, send me an email, reach out to me on Teams. But hope you have a great day.